What's going on guys? My name is Ben. How are you guys doing today? And what I have for you today is a review of the PSP headphones with remote control. And of course I got this in white and this actually came with my PSP 1000 itself. So let's take a look. So these are the headphones. They're just headphones. So let's just put those all to the side and take a look at the real action here. So here what you have is a remote control. Now this remote control is basically to perform functions when you're playing audio, uh, video, photos, and uh, when you're listening to a game or something. No, not listening to a game because you, know, you can't even use these when you're playing a game. The only thing you can use is these volume buttons right here. But we have the volume buttons right here. And on the top, you have a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, which is actually where your headphones are actually going to plug into now please note if you were to plug your headphones into this and you plug into your PSP directly if you were to do that without this um, the audio quality isn't going to change it'll stay the same and of course over here you have your hold switch right here now what this hold switch does is basically lock all your controls that you're trying to do on this little remote control right here as well as a belt clip right here so you can clip it onto your pants or your belt etc and of course the white cable right here is actually a little bit thicker than the cable that's directly on the headphones itself and then it's got this 3.5 millimeter headphone jack plug right here as well as this strange looking plug right here which I have no idea what that is but I'm pretty sure that's to power the remote control a little bit more and then here are the headphones itself and as you can see the wire on these headphones they're a little bit thinner than the actual wires on the remote control itself and the reason why I'm reviewing these headphones is because I really love these headphones like I've had these last long for me I believe they last from 2006 all the way up to 2011 so uh, almost six years uh, you can say and these headphones are really great the only reason why I don't use them right now is because one side of them isn't working so the other side is working but the other side isn't working and it took that long for these headphones to malfunction Look at the Apple headphones, for example, the, the Apple headphones, they break really easily and, and then they would just lose audio quality you know, very easily. I think Sony really did a great job producing these headphones and I'm not sure what the technical specs are for these headphones, but I really do love these headphones. So you guys want long lasting you know, headphones so you don't have to buy wireless Bluetooth headphones or something. These are definitely a solution you can get. Now, what I'm actually going to do right now is actually demonstrate this remote control right here because this is an accessory that came with these headphones right here. And you can actually purchase these from Amazon if you still have a PSP or you're just doing it to get the headphones themselves. This will run you on Amazon for just about $7.12. And if you were to get them new, $1.55 and used is $0.99. Cents. Okay, so I got my PSP right here and it's all booted up and ready to go. And you know, like I said before, the audio quality won't change and you just have these headphones uh, plugged in directly into the PSP right there, uh, like so. So we have the remote control right here. You know, this really nice remote control that's dangling around. <laughs> and then we can just plug it into this headphone jack right here as well as this strange looking plug right here. So let's plug it in. Okay, as you can see, it just says heavy, and then you can actually change the tone of the music itself. So we are on pops right now, jazz, unique, and off. Uh, I currently have it off because I don't see a difference between those. And then we'll just plug these in directly. You don't have to do that, but I'm doing it for sake purposes. And you can play to play your song, and we can go back. You don't have to do that. You can uh, basically just go into your menu, music menu with the integrated controls on the PSP itself. And of course, you can basically just play your music like that. And of course, you can uh, control the volume as you see right here. Okay, and you can go to the next song. And you can go back to start the song all over. Or double tap. And then... Uh, you go back to your previous track right there and you can pause it 
I can have it playing, and then I'm going to put it on a hold right here. Okay, so it's on hold, so the yellow indicator indicates that it's on hold, and I can't control it using the remote control. This is actually good because if you have this on your belt clip or your pants or something, and you accidentally bump into something, these buttons can be pressed. And then you can just use the uh, regular controls on your PSP. The only time that uh, your controls won't be working on your PSP is if you have the hold switch uh, right here put on hold and then you, know, you can't control anything. Plus, you have this little key lock indicator right here to indicate that your uh, system uh, is on hold right now. And then we're going to take it off of hold right here. And then you can basically just go back to your next track and then you can basically just do whatever you want and you can push to hold it and fast forward or uh, do it the same thing on the other button with the previous button and then you'll rewind the song itself so overall what do I think about this uh, PSP headphones with the remote control I really do like the remote control functionality and whenever I'm listening to music I use this but I don't use it that much anymore because I have an iPhone to do that an iPhone and an iPod and then the PSP is just basically used for games however this is a nice little neat accessory right here and especially the headphones itself you know the headphones do have really great sound quality right here they're not they're not very high quality sound as some of the newer headphones out there like the skull candies or the beats huh? power beats or something like that but these are nice basic headphones and you do get some bass out of them not the strongest bass as you would get with some of uh, the newer headphones out there however uh, these do have really great audio uh, quality right there and if you guys want to buy these off of Amazon go ahead and if you're gonna just do it for the headphones themselves and not even use the remote control then fine go ahead you know I used this on my iPhone before it works nobody says that it doesn't Anyway guys, this is a review of the PSP headphones with the remote control. If you guys like this video, please click the like button down below. As well as subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos from me like this. And follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash Ben. I like I to stay updated when I post a new video, why I haven't posted a new video that day. Am I busy? Am I not busy? I will see you guys in the next video. You have a good day now.